Jesus, you're everything to me. All I am, I never want to be. For you have been my dearest friend, provided all my needs. Oh, Jesus, you're everything to me. You've been my strength in weakness. You've been my hiding place. You never fail to answer when I call. And when I think of where you brought me from to where I am today, deep within my soul, I begin to sing, oh, Jesus, you're everything to me, yes, you are, Lord, all I am and ever hope to be. For you have been my dearest friend, provided all money is for oh, Jesus, your everything to me. Just to say I love you would never be enough to tie you all that you have made to me. And when the rocks not easy and I stumble on my way, you are standing there to catch me, should I fall, oh, Lord Jesus, you're everything to me, Lord, you're my everything, all I am and ever hope to be. For you have been my dearest friend, provided all my needs. Oh, Jesus, you're everything to me. Oh, yes, Lord Jesus, you're everything, everything to me. Father, I thank you this morning. I give you praise. Jehovah, I celebrate your name. I give you glory for you are worthy of all my praise. There is no other God besides you. You are the Alpha. You are the Omega. You are the beginning of my life. You are the middle of my life. You are my life story, Lord. You are my all. Father, I worship you this morning and I thank you for the honor and the privilege to bring your word once again. Lord, I thank you for keeping me alive and I thank you for all that you have done. Blessed be your holy name. I pray this morning for everyone that will be turning in, oh God, everyone that will hear this word, that as we read your word, Holy Spirit, that you will breathe into the life of everyone in the name of Jesus, that your word will come alive and give hope and give strength and renew and restore in the name of Jesus. Amen. I cover the atmosphere with the blood of Jesus. Thank you, faithful Father, in Jesus' name. Amen and amen and amen and amen and amen. Good morning, good afternoon, 
Good evening, good whatever time of the day it is, wherever you are. Once again, this is it, just a, a teaser bringing you the reading of the Bible as days from Fire Rings International Facebook page. Hallelujah. I'm excited because today I give God glory for it is my birthday. Oh my gosh. Today is my birthday. And I just thank God for preserving my life, for keeping me in faith, and for ensuring that up today I'm still in the faith, working with Him. It's been my all in all, and I honor and give you praise. Thank you, Father, in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Oh, yes, we're still in the book of, of, of Psalms, the book of poems, of prayers, of blessings, and of worship unto God. So I'm just going to share my screen as we dive in and begin to read. And yesterday we stopped in Psalm 42, and we'll be taking off from Psalm 43 this morning. Hallelujah. Praise Master Jesus. And of course, as always, I must make the declaration that the Bible is the one that only through living, the Bible is the, is the word of the one and only true living eternal sovereign God and of his son Jesus Christ, who is both Lord and Savior and the son coming King. Hallelujah. Of course, we are enjoying the effort to read, study, meditate on the word. And you can get the scriptures in Joshua 1, 8, Psalm 1, verse 1, 3, Psalm 19, verse 7 to 11, which we did see when we were there. John chapter 5, verse 39, 2 Timothy 2, 15. And of course, like I said earlier, we are still in the book of Psalms, blessings, prayers, poems, and songs of worship to the Lord. Hallelujah. And we're taking up from Psalm 43. Sorry for that. I'll just go out and just quickly make the correction. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Oh. Hallelujah. Is it possible that we didn't get in Psalm 43? Let's find out. Hallelujah. We can jump to Psalm 44. So if you give me a few seconds, I'll just get Psalm 43 uploaded and we'll be done in Jesus' name. Amen. Hallelujah. Psalm 43. Oh, I see. It's so brief. And maybe that's why. <laughs> Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Just give me a few seconds and we'll be there in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. You are worthy, O oh Lord. You are worthy. Oh Lord, you are worthy, oh Lord. Thank you, Jesus. You are worthy, oh Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Um, you are worthy. Just pardon me because I have to do so. But then you can enjoy the song. Oh, by the way, the song I sang earlier at the beginning um, is a song by, I think, the Brooklyn Choir. I have no right um, to, um, to the songs. So, but praise God. <laughs> All things belong to the, to the Almighty God. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Oh, praise the Lord. Oh, praise the Lord. Oh, praise the Lord. Thank you, Father. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. I praise the name of Jehovah. 
or has given me strength and joy. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. I'm just preparing this slide for some fourth three. And um, yeah, I didn't realize that it was missing. Oh, Father, have mercy. It will be ready in a jiffy. Praise God. Thank you for your patience, for your love. Aha, we are almost there. I'm almost done. Thank you, Father. In the name of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Oh, there we are. Oh, there we are. Almost there. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Yeah, it's quite some work loading and loading the slides, but then it's also a pleasure knowing that somebody is going to be blessed by the reading of the word. So pardon this oversight. This is not a technical hitch, is it? So when we get off reading the word, we'll be there in a GV in Jesus' name. Thank you ever so much for your patience. There we are. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. There we are, all done, all set, all ready to go. Amen. Wow, praise the Lord. I'm ready to go. Yeah, I'm just going to pick up my slide again. And uh, we should be good to go. There we are. We're taking up from Psalm 43. Amen. Hallelujah. Thank goodness we're reading just six Psalms. Amen. Psalm 43, prayer to God in time of trouble. Vindicate me, O God, and plead my cause against an ungodly nation. O deliver me from the deceitful and unjust man. For you are the God of my strength. Why do you cast me off? Why do I go mourning because of the oppression of the enemy? Oh, send out your light and your truth. Let them lead me. Let them bring me to your holy hill and to your tabernacle. Then I will go to the altar of God, to God my exceeding joy. And on the heart, I will praise you, oh God, my Lord God. Why are you cast down, oh my soul? And why are you disquieted within me? Hope in God. For I shall yet praise him, the help of my countenance, oh my God. Hallelujah. You know, one thing I love about David when he speaks, even in the times of trouble, he knows how to turn around and give God praise and give God glory. Hallelujah. Psalm 44, redemption remembered in present dishonor. That's very significant because sometimes you find yourself being dishonored, but you know what? There is redemption, there is hope for you. Always hold on to the Lord. And that was what David did. Today, we, 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 God has given us the privilege the, 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 the privilege to be able to assess the life of this man and be able to see what he, Jehovah, does in the life of the one that trusts in him wholly with all of his mind, his heart, and all. So trust in the Lord and hold on to him with everything that you have got. 
in Jesus' name. We have heard with our ears, oh God, our fathers have told us the deeds you did in their days, in the days of old. You drove out the nations with your hand, but you plant, but then you planted. You afflicted the peoples and cast them out, for they did not gain possession of the land by their own sword, nor did their own arms save them, but it was your right hand, your arm, and the light of your countenance, because you favored them. You are my king, O oh God. Command victories for Jacob. Through you, we will push down our enemies. Through your name, we will trample those who rise up against us. For I will not trust in my bow, nor shall I shall my sword save me. But you have saved us from our enemies and have put to shame those who hated us. In God, we boast all day long and praise your name forever. Selah. Did you see that? Do not boast in your ability, boast in the God that you have, boast in the God that is on the inside of you, boast in the fact that our God is mighty, is well able to deliver you. And this is what David is doing right now. Hallelujah. He says something significant. He said, I will not trust in my bow, nor in my shield, my sword to save me. Do not trust in anything but the Lord. Hallelujah. Amen. But you have cast us off and put us to shame. And you do not go out with the armies. You make us turn back from the enemy. And those who hate us have taken spoil for themselves. You have given us up like sheep intended for food. And have scattered us among the nations. You sell your people for next to nothing. And are not enriched by selling them. You make us a reproach to our neighbors. A scorn and a derision to all around us. You make us a byword among the nations a shaking of the head among the people. My dishonor is continually before me and the shame of my face has covered me because of the voice of him who reproaches and revives. Because of the enemy, the avenger, all this has come upon us. But we have not forgotten you, nor have we dealt falsely with your covenant. Our heart has not turned back nor have our steps departed from your way. But you have severely broken us in the place of jackals and covered us with death, with the shadow of death. If we have forgotten the name of our God or stretched out our hands to a foreign God, would not God search this out? For he knows the secret of the heart. Yet for your sake, we are killed all day long. We are accounted as sheep for the slaughter. Awake, why do you sleep, O Lord? Arise, do not cast us off. Cast us off forever. Why do you hide your face and forget our affliction and our, and our oppression? For our soul is bowed down to the dust. Our body clings to the ground. Arise for our help and redeem us for your mercy's sake. Hallelujah. The Lord will never turn you over to the enemy when you stay with him. He will not take off his guard. Anyway, what happens is when you go out of line with the word of God, you are the one that steps out of his protection. And of course, the enemy comes after you without a stop. So be careful to stay in the law of God, in his protection by staying in his word, obeying his word at all times. And whenever you miss it, be willing and be, you know, be humble and ask the Lord for mercy and forgiveness. And the Bible says he will abundantly forgive you. Hallelujah. May the Lord help us in Jesus' name. Psalm 45, the glories of the Messiah and his bride. My heart, my heart, excuse me, my heart is overflowing with a good thing. I recite my composition concerning the king. My tongue is the pain of a ready writer. You are fairer than the sons of men. Grace is poured upon your lips. Therefore, God has blessed you forever. Gird your sword upon your tie, O mighty one, with your glory and your majesty. And in your majesty, write prosperously because of truth, humility, and righteousness. And your right hand shall teach you awesome things. Your arrows are sharp in the heart of the king's enemies. The peoples fall under you. Your throne, O oh God, is forever and ever. A scepter of righteousness is a scepter of your kingdom. You love righteousness and hate wickedness. Therefore, God, your God, has anointed you with the oil of gladness more than your companions. Hallelujah. This is talking about Jesus. 
All your garments are scented with mine and aloes and cassia out of the ivory palaces by which they have made you glad. King's daughters are among your honorable women. At your right hand stands the queen in gold from Ophir. Listen, O oh daughter, consider and incline your ear. Forget your own people also and your father's house. So the king will greatly desire your beauty because he is your Lord. Worship him. And the daughter of Tyre will come with a gift. The rich among the people will seek your favor. The royal daughter is in all glory, is all glorious within the palace. Her clothing is woven with gold. She shall be brought to the king in robes of many colors. The virgins, her companions who follow her, shall be brought to you. With gladness and rejoicing, they shall be brought. They shall enter the king's palace. Instead of your fathers shall be your sons, whom you shall make princes in all the earth. I will make your name to be remembered in all generations. Therefore, the people shall praise you forever and ever. Hallelujah. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Our God is a great God. Jesus is coming again. Praise the Lord. Psalm 46. God, the refuge of his people and conqueror of the nations. God is our refuge and strength a very present help in trouble. And I can testify to that. Therefore, we will not fear, even though the earth be moved and though the mountains be carried into the midst of the sea, though its waters roar and be troubled, though the mountains shake with a swelling sea. There is a river whose streams make glad the city of God, the holy place of the tabernacle of the Most High. God is in the midst of her. She shall not be moved. God shall help her just at the break of dawn. The nations rage. The kingdoms were moved. He uttered his voice. The earth melted. The Lord of hosts is with us. The God of Jacob is our refuge. Selah. Come and behold the works of the Lord who has made desolations in the earth. He makes wars to cease. He makes wars cease to the end of the earth. He breaks the bow and cuts the spear in two. He burns the chariot in the fire. Be still and know that I am God. I will be exalted among the nations. I will be exalted in the earth. The Lord of hosts is with us. The God of Jacob is our refuge. See that. Hallelujah. The God of Jacob is our refuge. Make the God of Jacob your refuge. From the moment Jacob recognized uh, the authority of Jehovah God over his life, guess what? He never missed one step. He was favored all the way, all the time. He was favored. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Psalm 47. Praise to God, the ruler of the earth. Yeah. Oh, clap your hands, all you peoples. Shout to God with a voice of triumph. You know, that's the song. For the Lord most high is awesome. He is the great king over all the earth. He will subdue the peoples under us. Amen. And the nations under our feet. Amen. He will choose our inheritance for us. The excellence of Jacob whom he loves. See that? Amen. God has gone up with a shout. The Lord with the sound of a trumpet. Sing praises to God. Sing praises. Sing praises to our King. Sing praises. Hallelujah. For God is the King of all the earth. Sing praises with understanding. God reigns over the nations. God sits on his holy throne. The princes of the people have gathered together. The people of the God of Abraham. For the shields of the earth belong to God. He is greatly exalted hallelujah hallelujah you know there's a song that says he is exalted the king is exalted the night i will praise him our god is exalted on high hallelujah and finally our last reading for the day psalm 48 the glory of god in zion great is the lord and greatly to be praised in the city of our god in his holy mountain. 
beautiful in elevation, the joy of the whole earth is Mount Zion on the sides of the north, the city of the great king. And that is a song that I would like to sing. For great is the Lord and greatly to be praised in the city of our God, in the mountain of his holiness, beautiful elevation, the joy of the whole earth. It's not sigh on the sides of the north and the city of the great king. Hallelujah. <laughs> Praise the Lord. Let's read on. God is in her palaces. He is known as a refuge. For, the, for behold, the kings assembled. They passed by together. They saw it and so they marveled. They were troubled. They hasted away. Fear took hold of them there and pain as of a woman in bed span, as when you break the ships of Tarshish with an east wind. As we have heard, so we have seen in the city of the Lord of hosts, in the city of our God, God will establish it forever. Amen. God will establish you in the name of Jesus. Amen. Selah. We have taught, O oh God, on your loving kindness in the midst of your temple, according to your name, O oh God. So is your praise to the ends of the earth. Your right hand is full of righteousness. Let Mount Zion rejoice. Let the daughters of Judah be glad because of your judgment. Walk about Zion and go all around her. Count her towers, mark well her bulwarks. Consider her palaces that you may tell it to the generation following. For this is God, our God forever and ever, and he will be our God, even to the end. Hallelujah. For this God is our God forever and ever. He will be our God from now, even on to the end. For this God, the God of Abraham, the God of Isaac, the God of Jacob is our God. He shall be our God. He is my God and forever he will be my God. Amen. I love the Lord with all my heart. With that, we come to the end of today's reading. And I want to say thank you. Thank you, Mary, for wishing me a happy birthday. The Lord bless you, sweetheart. I'm so grateful. I'm grateful to God. And right now, I'm going up to have a very wonderful time with the Lord and with the people of God and with the saints. Hallelujah. The Lord bless you, keep you, and make his face shine upon you. I trust the Lord that you have been blessed with the reading of the word. Once again, this is Ijoz Agatise for Fire Springs International Facebook page. And I'll see you tomorrow again as we continue our journey with the book of Psalms. Until then, keep trusting in the Lord and trusting in nothing else. Hold on to God and you'll be blessed. God bless you. See you tomorrow. Amen.